Hello everyone. Uh, this is the new series that I've been uh, toying with doing and uh, since uh, I terminated the City Skylines one uh, last week uh, due to instability in the game, as in it was crashing on startup uh, 9 out of 10 tries at least, so it just was no good. So uh, I decided I was going to uh, go with a game that uh, that I uh, discovered a while back, and I've been playing for a while, and uh, you know I picked up the pre-alpha for it on itch.io, uh, and uh, if you like the game, you can go ahead and do the same thing, uh, and you'll get a Steam key when it releases on Steam, uh, as I understand it. So, so yeah, that will uh, there's that. So this is basically a tycoon game and an industry management game of a sort. And uh, yeah, so I'm I'm going to start a game from uh, uh, basically from the from the start. And uh, so here, let's uh, let's do a new game. Uh, if you're wondering about the company name, Akashic Inc., that's just a thing. Um, uh, you can look up what Akashic look up Akashic re record, and then you'll have an idea what it means. It's just a name that's okay. Yeah, that'll do. Need a name that'll work. Uh, we'll go with that color. We'll use dollars. You know, why not? Dollars is fun. No. Um. We'll use dollars. Yep. We'll use U.S. city names because I can generally pronounce those. Eh, whatever world seed that doesn't really matter. It's a procedurally generated world. So now I'm not going to allow trains to turn around at the station. Uh, but by doing this, it means that you have to have uh, uh, turnaround loops at stations. So that does make it a little bit harder. Uh, I'm going to leave everything else on normal. Now for the world bit, I'm going to go for a normal region and normal mountains, normal lakes, normal plants. No mods, okay? Uh, so this is going to be basically a bog standard game with the exception of uh, train turnaround. You know, you can turn it on, turn it off. Uh, this, um, yeah, there's no uh, tool tip for that. So, uh, right. So, and then over here, yeah, this was the general stuff. I don't know what we'll get with that world seed. So, uh, let's uh, start the game. Yeah, so it's going to um, do a bunch of setup, and anytime it's generating a region, it'll say exploring the world. Uh, you know, uh, whether you can read that or not, uh, probably not. But uh, you know, this this bit down here, that's exploring the world. Yep. Uh, okay, so uh, we got to wait for it to actually generate the world. So yeah, now the initial load up, it has to explore re effectively three regions. Uh, because you start out with a an area, uh, and I'm going to pause. Uh, we'll close the pro tips. Uh, uh, it's a Charlestown region. So what have we got here? We've got the, all the starting regions have iron, uh, wood, and coal. Uh, these aren't too bad for deposits. And we'll, we'll have three towns in each one. Oklahoma City only has one. <laughs> Cute. Uh, right, okay. Uh, we're in a temperate biome. Uh, we got two that demand iron ore and one for each of the others. Okay. So Oklahoma City has a business that's demanding iron ore. Um, we got uh, Charlestown wants uh, coal. And uh, New Paltz wants iron ore and wood. Now let's take a look here. We got coal over here. Uh, we got iron ore over here. Uh, so we can supply these uh, pretty nicely. Now something in the uh, pre-alpha as it stands right now, the towns have a natural grid that they grow on. Uh, so if you can keep your streets or your roads on that grid, then you, you'll avoid a lot of um, issues uh, with the towns building uh, ludicrous roads all over the place, you know, like a road right beside a road, you know, that sort of thing. 
So uh, you can tell here the natural grid is going to have an intersection point here. Uh, so I can, uh, what I can do here, uh, I'm going to use trucks initially, uh, and that's because that's uh, cheaper. Uh, so I can take this road here, and I can bring it up into here. And that will get me a uh, connection up to here. Uh, and I can bring this road out this way. And it gets me to the uh, coal. I'll just bring it out to there. Uh, right. Okay. So now uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring coal into this um, this uh, uh, business here, this, uh, what do they call it? Yeah, um, this boiler house, right? Uh, so if I bring coal into there, uh, that means I need to get coal out of here. Now that means uh, I'm going to need a coal mine and a, a station thingy. Now, uh, getting this, uh, this going, uh, the first thing I'm going to do just to make my life easier is uh, level this area a bit right uh, okay now uh, what i can do i'm going to need a station to pick up the uh, the the coal uh, so that that's going to be a terminal uh, so i'm going to put that over here um, right so if i put that there now, there's a reason I put it in that orientation. And I'm going to put a garage here uh, so I can launch uh, trucks from there. Now, I'm going to need a coal mine. Now, coal mines uh, have storage as part of them. So, uh, trucks can pick up directly from that. So, I'm going to... I'm going to drop... I'm going to drop two... Uh, well, two, yeah, coal mines, yeah, uh, and those will uh, start operating, and then over here, I need to, uh, to do the, uh, which, do we have any indication which way the grid is uh, going? Okay, so narrow is side, is side to side here and long is up and down okay so the way it, it works uh, is the grid like will be uh, say a road width is three so we got one two three so we got one road width one two three one road width in, in between two road widths three road widths right uh, so the fourth one is the next road and going the other way, it's six will be the next road. Um, so uh, we got the four one is side to side here. So the long one is this way. So what I can do is work this out. We got uh, one, two. Oh, come on. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, th okay. One, two, three, okay. And this would be where the natural road would be. Yeah. Okay. So, so, uh, so we can take those out. Now, uh, so what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to I'm going to take that out so that I can do this. No, 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 no. Okay. Now, what did that do? Oh, okay. I see what it did. Well, uh, then I'll uh, take that out and do this yeah okay oh come on uh, right and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uh, take a terminal 
and I'm going to stick it right here. Now, by sticking it here, this uh, coal thing is in the 100% ring for the delivery. Uh, so that means that when the uh, truck arrives, I'll get 100% of the uh, potential profit, right? Uh, okay, so now we're going to buy uh, a truck. Now, at this point, we only have one option until we get some research going. Now, uh, so this one can carry iron, so we'll do that. Uh, uh, we'll carry ore. So we'll grab the uh, coal ore, uh, the coal um, uh, type, and we'll uh, buy one of those. Now uh, we'll add a full load at the uh, mine. And then we'll go over here and we'll add a full unload here. Right, okay. So that gets us uh, a truck. Now, we'll set it up with a line, um, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate it once. So I'm going to run two trucks on here. Now, uh, let's unpause the game and release the trucks. Now, you'll see uh, the uh, it will fill up at the, uh, the, the mine. And then it will uh, trundle off to the uh, to the delivery point. Now, uh, I'm going to actually bring up the budget here. Uh, we've spent um, a fair chunk of cash, um, uh, 390k, just getting this far. Now, I'm going to repay this for the moment. Uh, anyway, when this uh, gets along over here. Uh, right, so th this will um, tool along here. Uh, I could speed speed it up, but at this point, you know, I you if you probably want to get a feel for uh, how the game runs, right? So it's going to come along down here, and then it will uh, it will come to to here, and then it will deliver to the industry or the business. Okay, so. Uh, trucks will turn around at the uh, end of a road. So there it is. It delivered it. We got $975 for the delivery. And now it will uh, head off back to the mine and reload. Now, as you deliver resources to the uh, business and uh, supply is demand, uh, it will pay less for the same amount of product, which is why you need to actually get your uh, your network uh, a little more established than uh, you know just one line, right? Um, anyway, uh, this uh, should uh, give you a demonstration of uh, basic line setup. Okay, so we're coming along here to the mine again. And now this is where you'll see why I set up the um, garage and uh, terminal in this configuration. So you come up here, uh, the truck will go up into the garage to turn around and then come back out uh, alongside on the correct side of the road for the terminal. Now what this does, uh, if we stop following it, uh, it means that you can have a truck waiting here to load, another one waiting here, another one waiting in the garage, another one turning around, another one here. So you can have several waiting and it doesn't block the main road because this would be a main road. Uh, that's why I do that. Now it's less of a concern at the business side as long as you're not delivering so much that the business can no longer take it all. In which, you know, uh, the truck will sit there and wait until the destination takes absolutely all of its uh, of its uh, cargo so it, with a full unload order. And, it, you know, as long as you're not oversupplying your businesses, that's fine. Uh, uh, now, uh, now we're, we're at a point here where... Um, where we need to uh, uh, deliver to something else. Now, uh, we're going to need uh, iron ore. So I'm going to uh, borrow a bunch again. 
yeah, we'll max out the loan. Now, what's this? Uh, oh, I could build a headquarters. Um, right. You know what? If I build it here. Yeah, I'll build it there. Um, yeah, it'll mean we get um, a little bit more uh, money for uh, our deliveries. Right. Uh, this is a new thing in a recent patch, so uh, that's why I forgot about it. Uh, no, it doesn't prevent the game from working if you don't uh, do it. Now, over here, I'm going to uh, flatten this out a bit. Uh, right. And then we're going to do the same thing over here. Uh, I'm going to build a uh, terminal. Uh, we're going to face it this way. Right. And then I'm going to uh, put a garage. And you'll note this is the same configuration, just rotated. And then I'm going to come over here in the mining. And I'm going to go into an iron mine. And I'm going to put two of those again. Now, uh, I need to uh, also uh, bring the road out to the main road. Now I'm not sure if this is on the proper grid, um, and, and I don't. I'm sure it's probably not. I'm not going to count it just yet. Uh, when the towns grow up to here, then uh, then I'll mess with that potentially. Now, uh, in here, I'm going to need to buy a truck. It's going to be the same truck again, but this time with iron. I'm going to buy it and I'm going to go back up here and I'm going to put a, I need a, a freight station up here as well. So, uh, so if I put it here, it's still a hundred percent profit for that business. So I'll put it there now. So I'll grab this and I'll go full load here. And then I'll go full unload here. Yeah, just like that. I'll turn it into a line. And then um, here, it's close enough. Yeah, I'll duplicate it. Now, uh, now if we release those, uh, and if I repay this some more, uh, we'll... Uh, We'll see that uh, we'll get uh, some sort of a payment here as well. And by doing this, um, you know, Oklahoma City should grow. Like population one, I've never actually seen uh, a town start with a population of one. So, you know, it's fine. Uh, so I can close that. Now, uh, these are coming up here. It's going to deliver them and we'll see what it pays. It should be somewhere in the same ballpark as coal, I think. Um, Seventeen fifty. Okay, so so that's okay. Now uh, over here, uh, what uh, what does this say? It's uh, five thirty. 350. 350. Yeah. Uh, no, I'm not dyslexic. I just uh, wasn't paying attention. And this one, 240. Okay. Yeah, definitely. Uh, now, uh, I can also, now we got this big hill here. So, uh, now we can also deliver both uh, wood and um, iron down here. And I think delivering iron down there might not be a bad um, business venture. Well, that's not going to uh, work particularly well. Uh, right. Uh, where's the wood? Oh, it's over there. Uh, okay, so if we come down from here, how much do we need? to do this 220 wow um 
Why can't we build there? Oh, we're going out of bounds. Okay. Well, in that case, uh, I'm going to uh, do some measuring here and we'll come in up there. Uh, okay, so we want roads. So one, two, oh, that's one. One, two, three, one, two, zoom in a bit. One, two, three, uh, one, two, three. So that's where the road would be. Okay. okay so we can, no, 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 no. Uh, it's really annoying because the, uh, there was a, I'm not sure if the shortcut for bulldozer is supposed to be uh, B or not, but it clearly isn't. So this is where the road would be. So if we do this, I can... Uh, apparently it's slash for the, the bulldozer. Uh, right. Okay, now uh, I can uh, come over here. Wow, that was um, crazy. Now, I can come up. Oh, yeah, if we avoid the hill, bring it up that way. Yeah, that's a lot cheaper. Now, how much money? We got enough money to buy some trucks here. So, uh, we'll wait. Uh, I need to to build a, uh, a, a uh, platform thing. Uh, this, we'll say that's in the way. Now, uh, we'll uh, put a, a freight station here. Nope, but I get 100 if I put it here. Okay. Okay, right. Now, uh, freight station. Both of them are in the 100% ring if I put it here. I'll put it there. Okay. Uh, right. Now, we'll buy uh, iron. We'll buy it. Uh, we'll grab it. And we'll go up here and uh, Add full load here and full unload here. Turn it into a line and we'll duplicate this one and I'll make four trucks on this one because it's a much longer line and release the ninjas. Now we don't have enough to uh, bring the uh, wood deposit online. Uh, so we'll need to earn some money first. Uh, but anyway, uh, that gets, uh, that should get a uh, fair chunk of, uh, of money coming in relatively quickly. Now let's, uh, Let's observe what we get. Uh, what's the uh, what's the payoff here at two fifty five? Hmm. Uh, I may need to uh, add some more uh, more trucks on these lines, but um, uh, that's uh, this is uh, basically getting started with the game. And as you can see, it's not terribly difficult. Um, and if this runs for a little bit, uh, it should give us uh, it should give a uh, nice solid uh, profit going. Um, and that's uh, definitely uh, going to be um, right twelve seventy five. Yeah, so that's paying better. Um, and is and this no no no. 
this is 395. Okay, so so we've got a little bit of inflation, I think, involved as well. So the prices will go up over time, uh, and that will make the uh, the loan uh, less expensive uh, to carry in real terms. So these are coming down here. What's the uh, payoff here? Five twenty-five. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So these will arrive and then uh, uh, we'll get a payoff. Uh, we're going to need a fair amount uh, to um, to implement the, uh, the wood, but we definitely want to. Um, Okay, so if we bring this up here, well, that's uh, that might be close enough, actually. Uh, right, so uh, what do we need here? We need a sawmill. How close does it have to be? There. Okay, 36. Now, if I uh, put a uh, freight station, which we can't afford, I can. Oh yeah, that's uh, that's in range. Okay, but if I put bring it up a bit more, I can get a range of two. Well, that's going to need twenty-one. Let's up the tempo, and we'll see if the the money comes in fast enough to be useful. 19, uh, 21, 20, okay, that's running costs ticking down, there we go, and put that there, put that there, how much is a garage, can't build here, why can't we build here, not enough money, we need 24k, 25k, Okay, so we let it run and see if it goes, you see if we can get the 25K. I want to get uh, all of the starting industries or, or businesses uh, connected up so they don't go out of business, right? And that's uh, money left on the table if you don't. Okay, so we got that. Now, uh, how much is the truck? 27K. Okay. So we've got to wait a bit longer. Uh, we don't have uh, additional loans, so uh, yeah. So that flattening I did 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 uh, have an opportunity cost. Uh, you know, pretty obvious that it did. Um, close that. Now, uh, so I'm going to get run this part till I get the uh, iron or the wood connected up to uh, to the town there, and then once I've done that, uh, I'll be able to uh, you know. There'll be a little bit of tweaking, a little bit of the game running uh, to build up cash. And then, uh, um, okay, that's going to be, no, 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 wrong, uh, cancel. Uh, okay, bye. I need this one for wood. Yeah, it's 29. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, so we just it just needs to well we we do have a net positive income at the moment so so that's good um, yeah so I'm, I think I'm gonna put uh, four okay we'll buy one of those now uh, we'll grab that uh, we'll put a uh, full load here and then we go down here and we do a full unload. Um, here what no uh full what wait who what no what um remove let's try that again um this one okay full load 
here. Right. Full unload here. Yes. Turn it into a line. Yes. Right. Close that. Now, uh, duplicate that. And you can't duplicate it again. That should be enough at least to get it started. So start it running. Uh, right. Um, down tempo it. Now we'll see what it delivers for. Okay, turning around. Ultimately, another road through here would be good. Right? And it delivers at 2300. Wow. Uh, okay. Uh, so far, so good. Um, right. Now, how much uh, do I need to build another sawmill? 36. I can't build here. There we go. Um, yeah. Let's see. Uh, well, um, if we up-tempo it, uh, this will... I uh, go a little bit faster. Uh, we're collecting wood and we're off like a shot. And now we're uh, we're net positive again. Uh, yeah, so uh, okay, so we've got uh, something basically profitable going here. Um, yeah. Uh, we're just about ready to take over so we can build a second one of these. Why am I building two? Well, it's so that uh, I don't uh, accidentally uh, overflow the production. Um, right. Uh, okay, so uh, this thing here is uh, population is growing. So, yeah. Uh, oh, we got, uh, you know, on the balance at this point, I probably should have uh, put... Um, uh, put the uh, uh, headquarters there, but uh, yeah, we're doing okay there, and uh, we should be doing okay up here as well. Uh, Oklahoma, oh, we're up to three people in Oklahoma City, so yeah. Uh, okay, so that is basically uh, getting started, you know. Uh, now, uh, there's a lot more to uh, consider here, uh, which uh, will be a uh, will be in the the uh, next um, next part here. Uh, I'll I'll be uh, going through some uh, uh, some additional stuff, uh, and we'll probably get some uh, research underway uh, so that uh, we can get better trucks and all of that jazz. Right, so. Uh, we're going to need a lot of cash, though, and, uh, you know, a, f a fair bit of um, uh, time and resources for some of it as well. So, uh, and ultimately, uh, we're going to start getting uh, production online for other um, more advanced resources. But uh, I'm going to stick with the basic resources for the moment, uh, and that's just to avoid uh, complications uh, at this stage, um, you know, basically just keep things uh, running uh, and not confuse matters uh, too quickly. Now, we will need to uh, get into uh, these new areas to get stone, copper, and sand. Okay. Uh, those uh, we will need ultimately. And there is a win condition for Voxel Tycoon. And that's when you research computing machines or whatever it's called, uh, computing devices. I can't remember for sure. Uh, but there is actually a win screen when you do that. So uh, uh, that is uh, the ultimate goal of the game if you're looking for a win condition. Otherwise, you can just play it open-ended like, like uh, Transport Fever or, um, you know, uh, Transport Tycoon or or uh, SimCity or whatever, right? Uh, you can play it fairly open-ended. Uh, 
So, yeah, that's um, that's uh, basically the uh, uh, the situation. But this is the uh, initial step where we get uh, a, a basic, uh, somewhat profitable um, company started, and uh, there's not much more we can do here until new demands pop up. Uh, or we have enough money to uh, buy uh, into a region, right? So yeah, that's uh, so. There's not much to do this part. I'll probably, if I remember, run the clock forward uh, before uh, starting up the next uh, episode. Maybe I won't though. Maybe I'll just let it play out. Uh, anyway, uh, that's going to be all for uh, for this part. Uh, there isn't really much more to do at this stage, so. Uh, it, it's largely waiting and, uh, you know, maybe planning and, uh, you know, looking at what's doing. Uh, what is this doing way over here? Huh. Yeah. Uh, well, whatever. Uh, anyway. Uh, so uh, that's going to be all for th for this part. So, uh, you know, stay healthy. Don't let the zombie apocalypse get you down too much. And then, uh, yeah, I guess... Uh, uh, I, I guess maybe I'll, I'll see you back uh, next time to uh, see where, where we go from here. Uh, anyway, uh, that's all for now. See you next time.